Hello! In this video I will show you how I design a 3D printed very useful box for crimping tool and pins. First of all I draw the shape of tool on guard paper to get all the centers of curves. I'm using Google SketchUp to draw this box. I'm not too good in 3D design, but in some strange way I draw this box like I imagined. First of all, I draw the outer dimension and then mark the centers of curves. Then connect it all together with straight lines and erase all the lines I didn't need. See the example here. To the angel I add the curves and delete all the excess lines. So I got something like this. Then I use offset tool and just offset all the walls for 1 mm. What is exactly 2 perimeters with 05 mm nozzle? Then add some drawers to storage the different kind of pins or ferrules or whatever you call it. When I come to this step, I use push pull tool and pull up the walls for 20 mm. Then extend the outer walls to 3 mm using push pull tool. Then raise outer walls for 2 mm but only 2 mm thick. When I got 3 of walls increased, I add 1x1 one one mm groove for cover. You can use follow me or push pull tool for this step. When I got groove on all 3 outer walls, our box is almost finished. Then make the cover. It's easy, just make 2 mm thick rectangle with 08 by 08 mm teeth around which will fit into the groove of box. So I got 0.2 mm clearance between box and cover. That the cover does not open itself. I added teeth to the end of the box and also add some groove for easier lift covered finger while opening. Just one more check if everything fit together. Now select the entire box and make a component. Then you can export it as STL file. Choose millimeters, OK, STL, OK, and then save. Now open the slicer, simplify 3D in my case and import the model. I don't know why the model looks like shit when imported into Slicer. Some of walls just disappear but when we slice it everything will be fine. Go through Slicer settings. I use 0.5mm nozzle, 2 perimeters, 3 top and 3 bottom layers and 10% in fill I think. I print with PLA, so set to 225 degrees. A bit high I know but I got best result with higher temp because bottom of the box is pretty big. Now slice it and voila, everything is ok, all the walls is there. But there you can see one problem, the first right drawer is covered up with top layers too, but I fix that in SketchUp later. I want to put support there for the groove, but S3D didn't want to make it. 
So I try to print without support and it's work. It print without problem 1 mm into the air. I don't know how because print it overnight. But the result was awesome. Let's print now. Remove the brim and smooth the edges. The best way for me to smooth the edges on PLA is to just scrap off with knife. Edges remain smooth and do not change color. Let's try now how it fits together. We can fill the box with pins now. I make a shake test and everything is stay on its place, so the box do the job. That's it. STL files and SketchUp file you can download from the link in the description. Like, share and subscribe if you like, thanks for watching and see you next time.